Please welcome We Want a Voice to Express. We are we, we are we want a voice to express and my name is Michael Torres. Good afternoon, my name is Yanis Rivera. And hi there, my name is Sergio Sanchez. Um, and we would like to thank our mentor, Stuart Patterson, just for all of support and everything he's done for us. Um, he's been a really big help and contribution to our project. So our problem statement. As we all know, the real world is not an easy place to live in. Someone is usually always trying to bring you down, but there's hope for the future. And as a society, we can't grow and learn more without getting along first. And that's one of the biggest problems that we saw. So our purpose and our hope was to bring the LGBTQ community, which stands for lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, and questioning youth together. In our project, what we did was we started a GSA at George Washington High School, which is a high school I go to. And it was a bit of a struggle to start it because not many kids showed up the first meeting. But throughout the whole um, initiation of the project, a lot of kids came into the meetings. We also designed a Facebook page called From One Voice to Express. We reached out and collaborated with this organization called Center on Hosta. And we researched and created a brochure for LGBTQ youth to, um, in order for them to be able to start their own GSA, learn about their own history, and the reliable resources they have. <coughs> um, this is the GSA at George Washington, a few of the members. And this was the first meeting. This is our Facebook page our layout and how it looks. And here are some of our posts. We typically post inspiring pictures, inspiring quotes, some stories, a little bit of the history of the LGBTQ community. This was our trip to Center and Halstead. And now here's a brief look of our brochure. Um, as you can see, there's resources, how to start the GSA, and the history of the LGBTQA community. Um, so what success did we have? Um, obviously, a lot of the groups here started out with very broad ambitions and um, just some, some ideas that weren't very much possible. Um, so one of ours was to start a brochure and to make sure that we can at least start a club in one of the schools. So um, for the GSA that was started at Yannis' school, um, we had 70 potential members that signed a petition for the club, and we only had 10 steady members. Um, currently, we are printing an initial run of 200 copies of our brochure that we made to hand out to various schools and other um, organizations, such as the Center on Halstead. Um, our Facebook page has 92 followers total from the Chicago area, which is for us was kind of a big deal since we started out with not, we started out with a lot of people who wanted to support us and showed that they did, really did care about this issue. Um, and so we also were able to learn some programming skills from the Center on Halstead. Um, they were one of the organizations that, contact, that contacted us back and was actually willing to help us um, be able to go out there and start a program of our own. And they really did help us to start this GSA and get it up and going. Um, so what did we learn? Me as a person, I really do enjoy math. So that's why this is in, a, in an equation. So I think one big thing that really does help <coughs> drive these, these different projects that we all did and we all had such an amazing success on is responsibility. That's it's such a hard thing to just be responsible with everything that you have to do. A lot of us had a lot to do and a lot on our plates and just to even take the time out of our day, out of our schedules to come out here and make sure that we got what we needed to get done um, 
it was amazing. You need dedication and you need to take the time to do that. And you need to be able to collaborate with people in your community and in order to be responsible about the things that you do. Um, so yeah. Thank you. And I wanted to say thank you to IIT, of course. Um, they really have been a big support of us, so thank you. Thank you.